My husband looks at me like I'm a crazy person when I ask him to save the tissue boxes. Don't throw them away, I say. I'm going to use them. One eyebrow raised. But I have really good reasons to save tissue boxes. This is a foiled Halloween tissue box, and the cardboard is wonderful. And I'm wearing one of those reasons right now. My pendant is made from foiled cardboard from a Halloween tissue box. It's orange on one side and purple on the other side, and I'm about to show you how I did it. Once you've chosen the size and shape that you want your pendant to be, you'll want to trim at least three pieces of cereal box thickness of cardboard to go in between. So you have a total of five. I have a purple to go on the back and the orange to go on the front. And you could do it with any color, any kind of cardboard, but there's something about the metallic that just looks really amazing. So your next step then is to glue. Leave the front for last because as soon as you get a little glue on there, that's hard to get off. Here's one that's completely dry. I have some colorful stripes on the back of it. I really like it. Now, I, I want to smooth the edges. These are kind of uneven. I wasn't as careful when I put them together. So I'm using a medium grit sand sponge. And I'm going to work until my edges are nice and smooth. These pieces are ready to get some dimensional sealer, which pretty much does the magical part. Carefully go right out to the edges. Carefully go around the holes. Now, when you have done both sides, you can use a clothespin to put it up on its side like this one. And just do one side at a time. Let it dry thoroughly. There we go. Right out to the edge. And it will be fabulous. Yes! The dimensional sealer is absolutely what makes it look magical. And once you've added your bail and your chain, and maybe a dangle from beneath, you're going to be really happy with how it looks. And don't even try to pretend you're not looking around your house right now for a box that you can make a pendant out of. I can totally see you. <laughs> I hope that you do make one. I hope that if you do, you'll send me a high resolution photo and a story about how you enjoyed it and I will put it on our website. Stay crafty, my friends.